Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Dynamic 365. Today we will learn how the marketing module works in Dynamic 365. For that, first we will look at the life cycle of uh, marketing module in the Dynamic 365. Yeah, this is the diagram which shows the life cycle of uh, marketing module in the Dynamic 365. So these are the entities which we have in the marketing module, which are campaign, marketing list lead contact and account campaign response so these entities comes under marketing module so in between entities we have relationships so those are marked over here first we'll look at the marketing list to campaign which marked as a one to end relationship which means one campaign may have multiple marketing list and marketing list marked to leads contact and accounts as a end to end relation means one marketing list may have n number of contacts one contact may associate to many marketing lists that's how the relation in between this lead contact and account with the marketing list and also we have campaign response which mark one to end relation between lead contact and account which means one lead can have multiple response for this campaign and one more is campaign to campaign response which marked as one to n relation which means one campaign may have n number of campaign response so this is the life cycle of marketing module in the dynamic 365 yeah let's get into the application and uh, we'll implement this uh, life cycle from end to end yeah so to implement this marketing module in the Dynamic 365, first I will create contacts to run the campaign. Let's go to the contact and I will create one contact. Give the first name, giving the name and last name. Let's give the email. click on save and close create one more contact I done with my uh, contacts creation just go to the marketing list click on marketing list click on new marketing list so it's asking the name let's keep the marketing list name target is contact let's save this yeah so since we are targeting as a contact so members should be contacts add the members yeah Numbers were added, then go back to the summary. So let's create one campaign for this marketing list. Click on new campaign, give the name. That's it. Click on save. Yeah, my campaign is created. I'm leaving uh, these things proposed start and proposed end date. 
so uh, these are like uh, uh, simple things when we uh, want to run this campaign and all now we need to create activities for this campaign so go to related click on campaign activities so click on new campaign activity it's asking subject so I believe the name that's it click on save here we need to remember one thing which is uh, very important in the campaign activity uh, which is a channel it's a pick list just select which kind of campaign activity you want to run for now I uh, will select the email and save now have contacts marketing list for that marketing list have created campaign and for that campaign I have created campaign activity sending offer email so I selected my channel as a email so I need to send my uh, email so to send that email from this uh, campaign activity in the ribbon we can see this uh, distribute campaign just click on here so it will give us one pop-up to send an email and also it's saying uh, use template if you have any uh, templates in the system you can able to select from here otherwise uh, just I don't have any uh, templates in now I will compose from the scratch here so it's, it's priority let's put it as high and uh, from address who is the sender I will give my address mail subject so I will give the subject name and uh, body let's we can design however we want our marketing mails uh, however it looks like yeah let's do some uh, design yeah that's it now just click on uh, distribute so here the mail distribution messages 
so it's asking the which kind of option you want this mail you want to assign to the owner itself or assign to any other person or team or create any activities in the queue so I don't want to select anyone just leave it like this just click on distribute so my mail uh, which I created now it's sent let's look at there go to campaign so this is the my campaign activity yeah so by clicking that uh, distribute campaign activity it will send the emails to the my campaign marketing list members so I have two members so which uh, ID so this is one email I got from the Mars CRM which I uh, distributed from the marketing list so I will do one thing uh, I will reply to this mail click on send yeah it got sent yeah this is another mail uh, which I got from uh, another contact so I will reply to this mail as well click on send close this so uh, I got two emails so I replied to that two emails one is uh, interested another one is not interested just look for the uh, replies which I sent to the mail came from the CR so, yeah this is the mail I replied so not interested and interested so just go back to our marketing list open this marketing list which I created for now and this is the campaign open this and go to details refreshed yeah I got created two response which I replied to the mail came from the CRM one is interested another one is not interested so it response code also captured via AI which installed in my uh, marketing module let's open this one and this is the mail and contact name mail ID so priority non channel everything is captured from the uh, mail and uh, campaign activity to the campaign response this is how marketing module works in Dynamo 365 that's it for now. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.